Number 10. The Biggest Animal on Earth About half a billion years ago, the largest animal that roamed the planet's oceans was, surprisingly, only about 6 feet or 1.8 meters long. That pales in comparison to what lives on Earth today. But back then, this animal was a certified giant. It was a strange sea creature only recently described as one of the largest arthropods that ever lived. If you're not sure what an arthropod is, it's a class of animal that includes crabs and spiders. This multi-segmented monster is currently providing scientists with amazing clues as to how things like spiders and crabs evolved to have legs from the dozens of flaps this ancient monster used to swim through the water. Fossils of this beast were discovered on a hillside in Morocco. Researchers were only able to discover about 50 fragments of exoskeletons belonging to the creature. The largest complete specimen measured about 3.6 feet or 1 meter long, though in life it was stretched over 6 feet or 1.8 meters, making it the biggest creature on Earth at the time. It was a filter feeder and sifted tiny little creatures, possibly including crustaceans or the larvae of other marine organisms. The animal has been dubbed Agyrocassus benmunle. It belongs to a group of animals called Anomalocaryodids, which can be translated from Italian as strange shrimp. Number 9. Russian Loch Ness Monster The Libyan Cured Devil is Russia's version of the Loch Ness Monster and just recently it completely destroyed someone's fishing nets. This strange water monster lives in a remote lake about 100 miles or 160 kilometers away from civilization, deep inside its icy waters. Nobody has ever properly documented the beast, but a brave travel adventurer named Andrei Solovyev recently camped out at the lakeside in temperatures that dropped far below freezing to try and catch the mysterious creature on video. Instead of spotting the giant animal, Andre claims it broke his fishing nets. It left huge holes torn in them as if warning him to leave. Stories about the monster have apparently existed in the lake since at least the 19th century, and there have allegedly been sonar readings that indicate at least one huge monster is lurking beneath the surface. There have been many sightings of the beast over the years, and even Andre said he saw something huge and dark swimming in the middle of the lake. Of course, he never managed to snap any decent photographs of it. The beast has been estimated at about 30 feet or 9.1 meters long. Nobody is sure where it came from, or if it's some kind of prehistoric ocean monster that got trapped in the lake and continues to breed in isolation, or if it's all just hype and imagination. Number 8. The Largest Octopus There is a giant monster living off the coast of British Columbia, Canada, and it is the largest known species of octopus on the planet. It's called the Giant Pacific Octopus, and the largest known specimen recently washed ashore and shocked scientists beyond belief. The octopus measured an outstanding 30 feet or 9.1 meters in length and weighed a whopping 600 pounds or 272 kilograms. Keeping in mind that the average size of a giant Pacific octopus is only about 17 feet or 5.1 meters long and 175 pounds or 79 kilograms. But that doesn't actually mean that this giant octopus was an anomaly. Some marine biologists believe the average documented giant Pacific octopus is just a baby. It's generally agreed that these creatures are able to grow far beyond 30 feet or 9.1 meters, possibly even up to 45 or 50 feet, 13 to 15 meters, with potential weights of over a thousand pounds or 454 kilograms. None of these giants have ever truly been documented, but it's believed that they could be living much deeper than scientists are able to probe. There are also theories that the reason for such a wide disbursement in terms of range and individual habitat for the giant Pacific octopus is because there is probably more than one species. Recent DNA analysis of distinctive specimens from different habitats indicates that they are all one species divided into three subspecies. Here's what you also need to remember. Giant Pacific octopuses have been around for millions of years, with their earliest ancestor dating back at least half a billion years ago. 200 million years ago, there were probably giant Triassic octopuses so big that they could feed on Ichthyosaurus, ferocious marine predators that grew over 40 feet or 12 meters in length and were rivaled only by the Megalodon. 
Number 7. The Kraken The largest sea creature ever imagined by human minds is undoubtedly the mythical Kraken. The Kraken is a legendary beast, described in some stories as growing to be about one and a half miles or 2.4 kilometers in length, with arms larger and thicker than masts of ships. Some claim the Kraken was originally based on sightings of giant squid, but nobody really knows for sure. Sailors used to worry that the Kraken could come out of the water at any moment to drag a ship into the murky depths. The Kraken was also associated with whirlpools, as it was said to be so big that when it emerged from the ocean, a huge whirlpool would form and swallow anything in its path. But how much truth is there to the Kraken? It was first mentioned in Scandinavian stories back in 1180 AD, with the sea monster residing near Norway and Iceland. Modern scientists have identified the Kraken as nothing more than a giant squid, with the first complete specimen of such an animal being caught for the first time in New Zealand in 1997. The animal is 25 feet or 7.6 meters long, although we know now that giant squid can grow to be up to 70 feet or 21 meters in length. Could a giant squid really grow so big that it could destroy a boat? Do you believe in the Kraken? Let me know in the comments below, and if you're liking this video, hit that thumbs up button, and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Number 6. The Ocean Sunfish The ocean sunfish is an animal of miraculous proportions. It is the heaviest bony fish in the world, with a maximum weight of around 5,100 pounds, or 2,313 kilograms. What's really fascinating about the ocean sunfish is that it doesn't have a tail. It only has two dorsal fins, which it uses to glide through the water. From the top dorsal fin to the bottom dorsal fin, the ocean sunfish can be about 14 feet or 4.2 meters in length. It has to eat a lot of jellyfish to support its massive weight, but is otherwise pretty peaceful. What makes the ocean sunfish one of the most extraordinary giant creatures in the ocean is how fast it grows and how big it gets. A baby ocean sunfish is so small that it can fit on the tip of your finger and weigh less than a single gram. Then, it undergoes the most impressive transformation of any animal in the ocean. It grows 60 million times larger than when it's first hatched, and it does it very quickly, gaining hundreds of pounds each and every year that it's alive. As a side note, sea lions in California are known to bite the fins off juvenile ocean sunfish and use them as frisbees. Number 5. The Biggest Great White On average, a great white shark is between 11 and 15 feet, or 3.3 to 4.5 meters, in length. However, perhaps the biggest great white shark ever seen by human eyes has been spotted more than once in recent years from the coast of Mexico's Guadalupe Island all the way to Hawaii. This massive shark has been estimated at over 20 feet or 6 meters long and is still growing. According to ABC News, it is the largest great white shark caught on camera and could be more than 50 years old. The shark was originally captured on video by Discovery Channel's Shark Week in 2013. Researchers managed to get a tag on the shark during their expedition. The tag is a scientific device that transmits the shark's location, depth, and other data to help better understand the animal's behavior and movement. The shark has since been identified as a female, and she has been given the nickname Deep Blue. In 2019, six years after her initial sighting, Deep Blue was filmed again by a documentary crew from National Geographic off the coast of Hawaii. She had a huge stomach and appeared to be pregnant at the time. Nobody knows if she has given birth since, but next time Deep Blue surfaces, she may have a giant young shark with her. Number 4. The Biggest Marine Animal The biggest marine animal in existence was recently spotted by an international team of ocean scientists. According to the report from Global News, the team labeled the giant marine creature as the largest living thing in the entire world. However, it's difficult to call the creature a single living animal. In reality, it is a monumental colony of tiny clones working together to form what you might call a giant jellyfish type of predator. One that looks like the world's longest floating shoelace. It's been called an alien tentacle, a long stringy thing and even an entity, but what it's really called is a siphonophore. 
the largest siphonophore ever seen was discovered about 2,000 feet or 610 meters below the surface, glowing in the darkness of the ocean. It was spotted by researchers at the Schmidt Ocean Institute. How long is it exactly? Difficult to tell because the siphonophore was coiled in irregular spirals. But scientists were able to make an educated guess of about 150 feet or 46 meters. Number 3. Giant Sea Monkey Biologists working with the Idaho National Guard have discovered a new species of shrimp that some have called giant sea monkeys. We all remember sea monkeys from our childhood. You sprinkle them into their tank and they grow into a small colony of creatures. But of course, sea monkeys were really just brine shrimp marketed to children as underwater apes. These brine shrimp grow to be just about half an inch. In comparison, the new species of fairy shrimp just discovered, very close relatives of brine shrimp, can grow to be roughly 3 inches, or 7.6 centimeters in length. That doesn't sound very big, but it's pretty huge in the world of sea monkeys. These are the biggest fairy shrimp in the world and the largest sea monkeys ever. Unfortunately, they probably aren't going to put giant fairy shrimp into packages and sell them to children as sea monkeys anytime in the foreseeable future. Did you ever have sea monkeys? Number 2. Rare Giant Squid Sightings of giant squid are exceptionally rare, and yet one of them washed ashore in South Africa just a little while ago, giving scientists a rare opportunity to study an intact specimen. It's hard to really describe just how rarely this happens. Despite how hard humans have tried for the past century, nobody has ever captured a live giant squid. For that matter, the first video of a giant squid swimming in the ocean was only captured in 2013. These things are huge monsters of the deep and extremely elusive. They're also smart enough to avoid humans and stick to the deepest parts of the ocean where we can't snatch them up. Giant squids are so big that they fight sperm whales. Expert scientists believe they can grow to be over 70 feet or 21 meters long. According to the people who found the squid on the beach in South Africa, it looks like a majestic prehistoric animal. Nobody could figure out how it died, and so far nobody knows why it washed up on the shore. Even though this was technically a giant squid, it was significantly smaller than you might expect. It only looked to be around 15 feet or 4.5 meters long. Number 1. The Giant Clam The largest giant clam ever found was over 4.5 feet or 1.3 meters wide. Giant clams definitely don't compare to giant sharks and monster squids when it comes to the most terrifying monsters in the ocean. But they are fascinating for just how heavy and big they can get. For example, how much do you think the 4.5 foot wide giant clam weighed? Maybe 100 pounds? Maybe 300? Nope. This clam weighed approximately 550 pounds. That is extremely heavy for something so small. But how is the giant clam so heavy? Well, most of its mass is actually inside of its shell. The meaty part inside of the clam only accounts for about 10% of its weight. It's the shell that's so heavy along with all the symbiotic algae living inside of its cells. The algae gives clams energy by transforming carbon dioxide into food using photosynthesis, in exchange for a safe place to live. The clam provides nutrients that the algae needs for the photosynthesis by filter feeding tiny animals floating in the reef. The bright color you see on clamshells is a direct result of the symbiosis with the algae, and all the stuff going on inside the giant clam shell is what makes it so heavy. Thanks for watching. What's your favorite giant marine animal? Let me know in the comments and be sure to hit that subscribe button and come back again for another amazing video. See you next time. Bye bye.